There are things you need to do so that your business can survive. If you neglect any of them here in this one, in your network marketing business, it will never see the light of day. Hi, Sam Ozani here. I'm so excited to be with you here once again. In this video, I will be exposing why most African network marketers don't make it to status level, you know, to superstar level. The reason is very simple, and I'm going to be enumerating a few of them. Basically, I have about three, but these three are so important because the reason why we don't become superstars, especially for African network marketers, you know, it's so simple, not so far-fetched. One would think that, um, you know, because network marketing is really gaining grounds in a lot of places, Africa, Nigeria, you know, the whole of African continent, you know, the continent of Africa, because we have a robust population of over a billion people. Um, network marketing has given hope to a lot of young people. Africa has a very young population, especially in Nigeria, where over 60% of the population is below 30 years old. Imagine that. So a lot of people have been able to bring in some economic welfare, bring in some good life through the proceeds. You know, network marketing has given them the opportunity to make money, extra cash, pay off debts, pay off school debts, you know, start up a life. One would think that, you know, in Africa, that with all the population, with uh, the explosion of network marketing in Africa, that we would, we would start seeing a situation where we have a lot of superstar results like we have in Europe, US, and other places. Unfortunately, that cannot be said about uh, Africa and especially Nigeria. And the reason is very simple. And in this video, I'll be breaking them down for you, all right? Okay, so number one, you need to treat your business like a business, your network marketing business like a business. A lot of people don't treat it like a business. They just think it's that thing that I'm doing that I just need to bring in people, probably sell a couple of products, and then I make money. No, network marketing is a real business. If you don't treat it like a business, it will never pay you like a business. That is why I tell my team, you must treat this business like a real business because it's a real business. You have to wake up early. There are things you need to do. You need to tend to your business. Now, imagine a brick and mortar business, a normal business that people engage in. You have to start up with the capital. You must make sure that your shop is open. You, uh, there are things you need to do so that your business can survive. If you neglect any of them here in this one, in your network marketing business, it will never see the light of day. Okay? So you must treat it like a business. But in Africa, um, several people just start the business and uh, they don't treat it like a business. They just attend to it when they feel like doing it. Sometimes they will not even uh, tell people about their business. They will not speak to other people about the business. They will not make any form of promotion. They will not uh, probably uh, go on Facebook to do some ads or pay for some ads. They want everything free. You know, even when you use your word of mouth, it's not very effective because you do not treat this as a business. It's a business. You know, you need to write out some business plans, what you need to do. How much are you going to commit towards adverts and making uh in advertising your business. Uh, what about the, the calls you need to make? You need to call some people. You need to tell them about your business. You need to send information about your business to people. So you need data. If you don't have all those things planned out, you just start a business. You know, I'm doing a business and then that's what it is. Then it will never ever treat you or pay you back like a business. That's exactly what I'm saying. So if you're doing this, you must treat it like a business so that it can pay you like a business. Okay? Number two, several people in Africa you know, Nigeria, Uganda, Ghana, Tanzania. I see this all the time because I have, I have large teams in these countries. You know, when you have a short-term mentality, there are things coming out all the time. You know, um, most companies understand that Africa has a very big population of young people. People that are willing to take their lives in their own hands. People that are willing to start up the business and all of that. So you see... We have almost on a weekly basis new companies coming in. So if you if you lack focus, if you don't ha if you have a short term mentality, what I mean by that is this: understand that your business requires a long term approach. Network marketing is not a business you will start in three weeks and you end it up in two months. No, you must give it somewhere around two to five years. This year is my fifth year in my company and it's been an amazing journey. I tell you. So you you need to give your business a minimum of two to five years. If you cannot 
give your business, your network marketing business, two to five years, then you are not willing to get it done. You, you're not willing to do what it takes or what is required for you to make that business pay you back handsomely. Okay, Because what we're pursuing in network marketing is time freedom, health freedom, financial freedom. You know, that's, those are the three things that uh, I got attracted to when I saw network marketing. Your regular business cannot give you the three freedoms. You know, you can run a business, but sometimes your business, you, you are required to be there all the time. So you do not have time freedom. You could have financial freedom. You could have health freedom, but you might not have time freedom. But network marketing is set up and then you can run it from your garage. You can run it from your living room. You can, you can run it from your spare bedroom. You can travel. Thank God for technology. You can operate your business from your phone. But you need to have a long-term mentality. And long-term mentality is a minimum of two to five years. That's the time that you can work your business from the beginning till it matures and gets to the point where it pays you, where you've built leaders, where you now have leaders who are willing to run the business. They don't work for you. Your, the people in your team, your downlines, they do not work for you, but you have a stake in their business. Whatever they do sort of counts for you, okay? So you must have a long-term mentality if you want this to happen. And that's the reason a lot of people in Africa, in Nigeria and other uh, countries around, basically continent of Africa, that's what I see. That's the bane of their development. That's the bane of their success in network marketing. Because they do not have what it takes to stick to something. Of course, there are groups coming up now that are doing so well. You know, they, they've been running a particular company for about 10 years. If you sample opinion, most people you see will tell you that in the past four years, in the past three years, they've been to like four or five companies. You know, if you do that, you will not create traction. You will not create the kind of traction that will help you run your business and, uh, you know, become very successful. So you must commit to two to five years. If you cannot do that, then maybe network marketing is not for you. Number three, this I have the three reasons why people do not hit the stardom, this, that the high income bracket. I'm talking about a million dollars every year. Number three is lack of skill. Remember how I ran through it. Number one, you need to treat it like a business. If you don't treat it like a business, it will never pay you like a business. Number two, you need to have a long-term mentality. And then number three, you need to acquire skills. Everything under heaven requires skills. You know, children are born, but they have to learn how to crawl. They will make mistakes. They will fall. They learn how to, you know, steady themselves. Then they start working. They fall. They work. They fall. Then before you know it, their legs are strong enough. And then they start running. They will have to learn how to write their names. They will have to learn how to feed themselves. You know, everything basically you know how to do right now, you learn everything. Even how to pronounce words, how to call your name, how to say hello, how to say good morning. You, you, you learn all. So in network marketing, we give you the opportunity because learning, according to Tim Sales, he says learning is the only thing you can lean on. Network marketing works when people are willing to learn. So you must develop skills because amateurs are not paid. Only professionals get paid. So you must be willing to acquire skills. And the skills in network marketing, they are very, very simple skills. If you can imbibe these three things that I've mentioned, your business is going to hit off the roof. You're going to stay long enough to reap the fruit of your labor. Okay? You need to understand that network marketing is just like any other business. You need to give it enough time to work. You need to be there, commit two to five years to it. You need to learn the skills. And most importantly, you need to understand that staying in this business is what is going to make it happen for you. Staying here long enough. There's a video I created about jumping around and the shiny object syndrome. You know, hit, click on the link up and you'll see it or somewhere down below. So these are the three keys that would stop you from hitting the stardom. That status symbol, that level of uh, professionalism, that's... That level where you would um, have all the benefits of network marketing. If you don't treat your business like a business, if you don't treat a network marketing business like a business, it will never pay you like a business. So you must treat it like a business. You must approach it from that business standpoint. The things you will not do in a normal business, please do not do it in your network marketing business. You don't do network marketing when you feel like doing it or when you've done every other thing. No, you must assign time to it. Let me also say this. For you to create massive results in one year, you must commit a minimum of 8 to 12 hours every day, productive hours. The same way you commit 8 to 12 hours every day in your job. You must commit. And someone will tell me, so um, what about doing part-time? You could do part-time if you want. But when I started, I started as a full-timer. Now, does it mean that part-timers cannot do this? No. Part-timers can, of course. 
But I'm only telling you that if you want massive success in less than one year, you need to create enough time for yourself that you must do your business 8 to 12 hours daily. That's what it takes. That's what it takes to hit the roof, you know, for your success to just skyrocket and you create massive success in one year. So if you're willing to do that, type down below and let me have your commitment that you're going to focus on your business. Or you're going to run your business 8 to 12 hours every day. Just the same way you run your personal businesses or where you work, where you are employed, you know, because as a nine to five person, you go to work in the morning and then you close in the evening. You put in at least somewhere around eight hours every day. That is also what is required of you in your business. If you want to create massive results in one year, if you want to take your time to create the result, fine. But I'm telling you this, that it's going to pay you better if you put in the time. And what if you go to work and then you come back in the evening? Of course, you can still put in eight hours. Yeah, of course you can. So make sure you cut down the time for TV, for sleeping and all of that. Put in the eight hours. Somewhere between 7 p.m. and uh, 12 midnight. And then you wake up early in the morning before you go to work and put in like maybe two or three hours. It's possible. You can do that. If you can't do it, then maybe the success you want is you really don't want it. If you want it bad enough, you do whatever it takes legally achieve your results okay so here are the three things first treat your business like a business have a long-term mentality then make sure that you learn the skills the skills are not so difficult we have final prospects invitation making the invitation presenting the business um, closing down prospects following up okay getting them started and then promoting events seven basic skills that will help you become the person that every other person is going to look up to as an inspiration because people are looking for inspiration. Become one. And I'm sure you can be an inspiration to your team. All right. So if you found this video very helpful, very inspiring, consider subscribing, okay? This is Bootrap Entrepreneur, Sam Ozani, and I'm so excited to have you on my channel, okay? Make sure you share this video to your team. And um, if you have any other option, if you have any other suggestion on how uh, African network marketers can become professionals and make superstar kind of income, kindly give us, you know, your suggestions down below. Thank you so much and bye-bye for now. See you on the next episode.